slide. Practice. I play tennis. Maybe you don't really like to walk or run. You have to have time for everything. Priority number one is work. Priority number two, family. No, family is not number one. Because your family, they don't want you unless you deliver to them. Therefore, you have to work hard. Otherwise, your wife or your children, they don't want to see you. They want somebody to deliver to them. Therefore, you have to believe in the priorities. A lot of people, they don't understand that. He said, when he went to hire somebody, he said, to became a my wife. This is useless. Fire him. From beginning, he's useless when he said, I want to consult my wife. That's useless. He should take a decision. Our rules, they say, there's a difference between male and man. The man who can take decision. The male can take decision. This is the life. This is our life. And we have to live with that, and we have to be honest. You know, if we can do that, this is number one. Number two is, you know, we should not stay late night working in the office or doing something else. No, no, you have to have your early. This is what I call it, uh, the constitution of God. Second, in leadership, I believe in that, you have to have consultation with your directors, with your people, to consult them, and everything. But the decision, final decision, should be used, not anybody else. But you have to weigh what these people, the directors, your assistant, because you are, without them you cannot succeed. And always you have to choose a people in your size, your partner to you in their thinking, or better than you. Never choose somebody lower than you. Because I don't want anybody to call me, yes sir, yes sir, and he lied to me. I want somebody to challenge me and say, no, no, no. Hala, you are wrong. This is, I will respect my director. I will not respect him if he accepts everything I'm saying. That means he's loving me. I want somebody to discuss it, to prove to me that it is better because this guy, this person, whether it's a woman or a man, if they stop me and say that, let us discuss it. Let us assess it. This person I will respect and salute them. I don't think I have more to, to say than what I have said. I hope I'm not bothering you to stand me. Thank you very much. And great to be here. Thank you. Thank you so much, His Excellency. I'm told that he has some very urgent matters to attend to and he will have to leave uh, the Dubai Global Convention. But before he goes, uh, General Alvarez, we would like to present His Excellency with a token of appreciation. Can we have the IOD mentor, please? Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for His Excellency Dr. Thank you. 